Quand vous êtes avec vos balais, vous êtes avec vos balais, quoi. On y est, voilà, on est fiers, on est guerrière, on se tient, on sort les, on sort les nibars et on est là, quoi. We are here. Three words that capture the message of French artist Sarah Trouche. Working alongside professional boxer and dancers from around the country, Trouche is best known for her politically engaged choreography. Like this piece, which challenges women's representation in the art world. This summer, I visited the major art museum in Bordeaux and many others in France. And I realized that women were always presented as widows, as beaten, raped, submissive or allegorical. Often associated with women's subordination, even exploitation, here the brooms are planted firmly against the ground, as if to set a boundary. Pairs of underwear form a circle where the protagonists tell their stories. It's underwear. I put out a call on social media and hundreds of women sent me their panties. As a man, we get an idea of what women go through. It's very powerful, very brave. This show really blew me away. She's one of the rare artists who creates a movement of energy. She invites the audience and other artists to join. Trouche, who was raised in southwestern France and trained in fine arts in Paris, makes visual art too, like the works on display at this gallery in the heart of the capital. Here, what we have in front of us are plaster heads of an artist molded plastic bags onto. These works represent self-association that takes place in our society, where really we don't want to see what's going on around us, so we cover ourselves up. Despite the often gloomy subjects she addresses, Trouche remains an eternal optimist. That's what especially interests me about visual arts. You can take on issues that are pretty serious, but you can also show a way out. For example, in the exhibition with the asphyxiated heads, with the blue plastic bags, by the time you reach the end, there's one who's practically a superhero. When it comes to heroes, Trouche also looks to the women of Benin. Her most recent project is based on the masked female figure of Gelede. Once a year, local men cross-dress in tribute to the mothers who give society life. For Trouche, it's one more way of transforming human bodies into art and beginning to unravel a tangled world.